Well, if you want to build software that is stable and as close to error-free as you can get it, the compiler is your best friend. Because the compiler is a program that checks that you have followed your own rules and the language's rules, even when that's very tedious and difficult. With a, um, with, with a dynamically checked language, uh, you have to rely on having completely uh, tested your program. And that never happens. The last bug is an old joke. I mean, you never get it. But if you have a systematic set of rules, which is what a language is, then you can have a machine check it for you. It doesn't bore, and it's much faster. And that comes together with the idea of the uh, abstraction mechanisms in C++. If everything you do is sort of hardware level, pointers, arrays, uh, built-in types like integers and floating point, eh, it's limited what a compiler can do for you except for generating code. If you abstract so that you have uh, hash tables and complex numbers and n-dimensional matrices or whatever um, graphical shapes with uh, manipulation of, of the graphics and things like that, then the compiler can start helping you uh, to avoid uh, stupid things. Um, in, in, a, in a runtime checked language, a dynamically checked language, you, you, you have an I.O. stream, a stream that goes out, an image stream, and, and you try to rotate it with an operation that is meant to rotate the shapes on your screen. Um, in a dynamically typed language, it will find the problem and give you an error and send you over into the debugger. In a compiled language, it'll say this program will never run. You have an error. And this is important because a lot of the application I'm thinking a lot about is are going to run places where there won't be a programmer. So sending something into um, an error handler or a debugger is not going to help at all. There won't be a programmer in the house. I mean, if, if that camera uh, decided that the program was wrong and it's done something, um, something bad, the only thing it could do is to stop. Uh, you don't want a telephone switch to stop just because there's not a programmer in the house or the engine of your plane or something like that, no. So the, the first reason the compiler is your best friend is that it catches errors systematically and early. This, by the way, means that you have to think a little bit harder when you write the code because you really have to get it correct. You can't just be sloppy and it works most of the time. That, that's not what a compiled language does. And the second thing is it generates much better code. So um, something like C++, it's not uncommon to find it runs 10 or 50 times faster than alternatives. But, but the first level of defense in the compiler is simply to get the code correct.